What makes Reserve Residence such a unique location is that it is directly opposite Bukit Timah and Rifle Range Nature Parks. This is part of the central catchment area which is never going to change and it will never be built on. This is the big benefit. This will be one of the greenest projects in Singapore. It's like a great green lung, the reserve residences. It's multi-layered. It goes all the way from the very top of the roof right the way down to a street level, all the way around all four sides of the project. Everywhere you look, you will see greenery. So the architecture will reflect it, the colors, the textures. That will also be in the landscape. They can go down into the garden, they can sit by the pool, the kids can run around, there's plenty of room. This is what we think of as coming to life, you know, that you meet neighbors, you make friends. Although this is a modern development with modern styles, we're actually bringing the natural context into the area, both with the planting and with the way we use materials. We develop what we call a plant palette, where we can choose the ideal plant that is likely to grow well in this place. Our principle, the right plant in the right place, that will make sure it grows, it makes sure that it can be maintained, it makes sure it will be there for many years to come. On top of that, we're trying to develop Singapore as a city in nature, meaning we want to live with nature. We want the whole city to be like a natural organism. We talk about connectivity for people walking, people bicycling. People need to be able to get to where they're going to go. For example, you've got the rail corridor there. Right past the reserve residence site is the Cross Island Trail, which is going to be a long distance walkway. There will be lots of opportunities for people to bicycle as well. For example, there's a new footbridge across Jalan Anak Bukit, which takes you to the rifle range and Bukit Timah. So, whether you live there or you are just visiting, you can find these attributes at the reserve residences. What is the biggest element in the landscape? It's the sky. The sky is endless, it's huge. And it's why we like being in big open spaces. As landscape designers, we believe that our work is not just to make things look good, it is to make things feel good and continue to work well for many years to come.